Thank you, precious listeners. 谢谢你们，珍贵的听众。Well, I want to share with you the message of what the Lord is saying at this hour. 我想要和你们分享主在这个时刻要给人们的讯息。I gave a prophecy on November twenty-first, the year two thousand and twelve. 我在二零一二年十一月二十一日说了一个预言。And in that prophecy, I was talking about the meeting that would be the end of year meeting. 那个预言是关于一个年末的聚会。And as I gave that prophecy, I said the glory of the Lord. Would come down from heaven like the cloud. 预言的内容是，主的荣耀会像从天而降的云朵。And I said that when that glory comes like the cloud, it would come straight into the meeting of the Lord. 当那荣耀像云朵一样的显现时，它会直接出现在主的聚会当中。Like it was during the time of Moses. 就像在摩西的时代一样。And sure enough, when that day came, 毫无疑问的，当那一天来到 ，when thirty first of December came， 也就是二零一二年十二月三十一日到了 ，that cloud appeared and you see different portions。那朵云出现了，你能看到云朵从高处降到低处的过程。You see when the cloud was about to touch the meeting， 你会看到云朵即将触摸聚会。And when the cloud finally touched the meeting, 以及那朵云终于触摸到聚会。Now that is a very significant event in the life of the church. 这在教会的历史中意义相当重大。What is the message that comes out of there? 这当中代表着什么讯息呢 ？When we see such events taking place now, 当我们看到如此的事件发生了。I want you to turn with me to the book of Exodus, chapter three. 请翻开出埃及记第三章。Let me begin verse four. 从第四节开始。It says, "When the Lord saw that he had gone over to look, 耶和华上帝见他要上前观看 God called him from within the bush, Moses, Moses. 就从荆棘丛中呼唤他说。摩西，摩西。And Moses said, "Here I am." 摩西说，我在这里。Verse five is the most important, right? 第五节是最重要的部分。Do not come any closer, God said. 上帝说，别再靠近。Take off your sandals. 脱下你脚上的鞋子。For the place where you are standing is holy ground. 因为你所站的地方是圣地。Hallelujah, Hallelujah. That is a very significant event. 这是非常重大的事件。When the Lord encountered in His glory, 当主亲自在他的荣耀中彰显。And this same glory, in this case, appeared as a burning bush. 在这个例子当中。主的荣耀彰显在火烧的荆棘丛中。Remember very well. 请记清楚。Later, when he appeared to them in the wilderness. 之后，主在荒野中向人们显现。In the night, burning flame. 晚上是火柱。In the day, the cloud. 白天是云柱。But when this cloud appeared. 但是，当这云朵出现时。He told Moses. 神告诉摩西 ，Don't come any closer. 别再靠近。For the place where you stand right now. 因为你现在所站的地方 ，is holy ground. 是圣地。Therefore, 所以 take off your sandals. 脱下你脚上的鞋子。Moses had been shepherding Jethro's sheep. 摩西本来为他的岳父叶特罗放羊。The earthly sheep, the worldly sheep. 那些是世俗的羊，尘世的羊。Taking care of them. 要照顾好他们。Earthly wealth. 这些世俗的财富。Earthly treasures. 尘世的珍宝。Until when he encountered the glory of the Lord. 
直到摩西亲身经历在主的荣耀当中。This same cloud appearing as a flame， 就是这朵云以火焰的形式显现。Because the Bible says he rides on the cloud. Because the Bible says he rides on the cloud. This is Jehovah Himself that visited this meeting. This is Jehovah Himself in the flame that this was Jehovah Himself in the flame that was now speaking to Moses. This is Jehovah Himself in the flame that this was Jehovah Himself in the flame that was now speaking to Moses. This is Jehovah Himself in the flame that this was Jehovah Himself in the flame that was now speaking to Moses. This is Jehovah Himself in the flame that this was Jehovah Himself in the flame that was now speaking to Moses. This is Jehovah Himself in the flame that this was Jehovah Himself in the flame that was now speaking to Moses. This is Jehovah Himself in the flame that this was Jehovah Himself in the flame that was now speaking to Moses. A shifting of his mind. Moses 就改变了他的心意 An instant transformation of the mind of Moses. Moses 的心意瞬间转变 An instant transformation of the priorities of Moses. Moses 生命中的首要任务瞬间转变 The values of Moses. Moses 的价值观 The direction of Moses. The mission of Moses, Moses' mission, from tending the sheep of Jethro, from 帮耶特罗放羊 tending the worldly sheep, 只照顾世俗的羊 Now the Lord is telling Moses, 但是现在主告诉摩西 Behold, I want you to go and tend the sheep of Jehovah. 看呐。我要你去照顾耶和华的羊群。And the Lord is using this now to speak to the church globally. 主正在使用这个意象，告诉全球的教会。He said, "Hey." 主说 ，Look. 注意 ，The glory has already visited here. 荣耀已经到访这地了。The cloud is here. 云朵在这里。That visitation does not belong to Kenya. 这云朵的到访。并不专属肯亚。That visitation is taking place in the house of the Lord, globally. 而是属于神在全球的圣所。And the message is this. 主要传达的讯息是。The Lord is now telling the shepherds. 主现在要告诉牧羊人们。The pastors. 牧师们。He's saying, because the glory has come. 主说：“因为荣耀已经降临了。”Now you must stop tending the sheep of Jethro. 现在你们必须停止牧养耶特罗的羊群了。The sheep of this world 属于世俗的羊群。You must stop being the shepherds of Jethro's sheep. 你们必须停止牧养耶特罗的羊群了。Behold, 看哪。This is now the hour to be the shepherds of the sheep of the Messiah of Jehovah. 现在就是牧羊属于弥赛亚的羊群，属于耶和华的羊群的时候了。The Lord is saying that this is the hour when the glory has come. 主说，现在荣耀已经降临。This is the hour when the priorities of the church must now shift. 现在就是教会必须改变首要任务的时候。From the gospel of the stomach， 要从只顾念肚腹的福音中改变了。Bread and butter， bring bread on the table。讲到的内容像是奶油和面包一样，只顾念肉体。The gospel of my rent， how will I meet rent？ 讲到的内容也像是要如何付房租一样。只传讲金钱的福音。The gospel of here and now, prosperity. 现今的福音都是在传讲繁荣成功的讯息。He's saying now the church has to focus into a heavenly gospel. 主说，现在教会必须致力于传讲神国的福音。The church must now change priority. 现在教会。必须改变首要任务了。And focus on the sheep, the treasures of Jehovah, the sheep of Jehovah. 必须致力于牧养耶和华的宝贵羊群。And we see very clearly here. 
，我们可以清楚的看到。In the book of Numbers， 在民数记。The book of Numbers chapter nine， 在民数记第九章。When the same cloud， this very cloud， appeared in the wilderness。当同样的云朵在荒野中出现时。First of all， look at this now。首先，请注意。The Lord shows Moses the temple of Jehovah in heaven. 主向摩西显现耶和华在天堂的会幕。And he tells Moses, "Can you build for me a copy, a copy of this one in heaven on the earth? Build for me a copy on the earth." 主跟摩西说，能不能帮我在地上树立一个像天堂般的会幕 ？And when Moses begins the mighty construction project. 后来，摩西开始在地上建造像在天堂里面的会幕。It was so mighty. 那景象非常伟大。But when Moses finished, 当摩西完成会幕的建造时 ，Then you see the glory came over the temple. 你将会看到神的荣耀彰显其中。And after that, 之后 ，From that day on, 从那天开始 ，When the glory lifted. 荣耀什么时候从会幕上收去 ？The Israelites packed their bags and moved on. 以色列人就收拾行囊出发。And by day, the glory was a pillar of cloud, leading them. 在白天，荣耀以云柱的形式引导以色列人。Because they had never been this way before. 因为他们从来没有走过这路。By night, it was a pillar of fire, leading them. 在夜晚，荣耀以火柱的形式引领以色列人。Because they had never been this way before. 因为他们从来没有走过这路。They did not know how to get to the promised land. 他们不知道怎么走到应许之地。Listen, precious people. 听着，珍贵的人们。In that way, Jehovah Himself shepherded Israel. 耶和华他亲自以这样的方式带领以色列人。And by Israel following this cloud, 因着以色列人跟随云朵的带领 ，Israel became the monument. 他们成了不朽的典范 ，the example for all nations. 全地的典范 of what it means. 因为这代表 to totally submit unto the Lord. 他们在主面前完全的降服。And be called the people of the Lord. 他们因而被称作主的子民。Be shepherded by the Lord. 被主亲自牧养。A monument, an example to follow. 他们成为大家可以效法的典范。And listen, precious people. 听着，珍贵的人们。Remove your sandals. 脱下你们的鞋子。Take off your sandals. 脱下鞋子。For the place where you stand is now holy ground. Wow! I look at the church in the United States of America. I see the church in Finland, the church in Europe, Australia, Asia, Canada. 我发现现今在美国、芬兰、欧洲、澳洲、亚洲、加拿大的教会。And there is one major characteristic they all share. 这些教会都拥有一个主要的相同特征。I see. Everybody is walking in the church with sandals. 就是所有在教会的人们都继续穿着脚上的鞋。They are trampling the house of the Lord with their sandals. 人们用脚上的鞋藐视神的教会。But the Lord is saying. 但是主说。That the appearance of His glory. 这是他荣耀降临的地方。The Shekinah glory of the cloud. 耶和华光云的显现。Is an announcement to the church. 这是对教会的宣告。He's announcing, saying, "Hey, time over. Stop it." 他正在宣告，时间到了，停止犯罪了。Behold the place where you stand now. 看哪、啊，你现在所站的地方 is holy ground. 是圣地。You cannot come with the sandals of sexual immorality inside again. 你不能再一次穿着那双情欲放荡的鞋子进入里面。This is now holy ground. 现在这里是圣地。You cannot enter with the sandals of false prophecy anymore. 
，你再也不能穿那双假预言的鞋进入。You cannot enter with the sandals of lies. 你不能穿着那双谎言的鞋子。Perversion. 堕落。Pornography. 色情。Abortion. 堕胎。Immorality. 邪恶。Witchcraft. 巫术。Whatever has become sin. 不管是哪一双。代表着罪恶的鞋子。And the mountain that is blocking the church， 像山一样庞大的罪恶阻挡着教会。Must now be left out。现在必须离开了。The false prophets， 假先知。Those are the sandals the church must leave out now。这些就是教会现在必须丢弃的鞋子。False apostles， 假门徒。And so the Lord is speaking here。所以主在这里要说。And he's saying, 他说 that now if there is any pastor that will not shepherd the church right, 如果现在有任何一位牧师不以正确的方式来牧养教会 the Lord Himself will now shepherd His own sheep. 那么现在主要来亲自牧养这些属于他的羊群了 This is the Lord Jehovah Himself. 就是主耶和华亲自要来牧养 The Bible says he comes riding in the cloud of his glory. 圣经说主要亲自驾着他荣耀的云朵降临。What a mighty dispensation! 这是多么强大的景象。That you may live to see these landmark events. 你能活着并亲眼目睹这个历史性的重要时刻。Precious people. 珍贵的人们。But we know it too well. 我们都知道。That At one time, 有一次 when Moses went up the mountain with seventy elders, 摩西和七十位长老上山 they were visited by this cloud. 而云彩到访了那座山 Somebody listen to this. 注意 there had been a lot of mutiny in the camp. 在他们的营中有很多背逆的事情 People are saying, "No, these are not leaders." 人们说不，他们才不是领导者。No, these are not elders. 不，他们才不是长老。And Moses wanted to shut them down. 因此，摩西想要终止他们的背逆。To quieten the camp. 使营内恢复平静。So he took the leaders, seventy, to the mountain. 所以，摩西带着七十个长老上山。And the glory visited the cloud. 然后。神荣耀的云彩就降临了。When the cloud visited them， 在荣耀的云到访后 ，they came down from the mountain prophesying。他们从山上离开后，开口说预言。They were giving prophecy。他们能开口说预言。The spirit of the Lord had descended on them from this cloud。主的灵从云朵下降，停在他们身上。What is the Lord saying? 主要说什么呢 ？When you look at the seventy elders, 当你看到七十位长老 ，the fact that they prophesied， 他们能说预言 ，established their credentials as leaders in the camp。他们能授权人们在营中领导的权柄。Today also， 在这个时代也是一样。The cloud has come。云的荣耀降临了。There has been a lot of mutiny in the church. 在教会中有许多背逆的事情。Mutiny between the world and the church. 属世的背逆与教会的背逆并没有区别。Sometimes the world says. 有时我们会听到人们说。Look, the church is nothing now. 看看教会，已经什么都没有了。She has fallen away. 教会已经堕落了。But the Lord has brought this cloud of His glory. 但是主已经带来他荣耀的云朵。To also establish the credentials of the church， 同时也授予教会领导的权柄。That it may be known that this is the church whose God is Jehovah。让世人知道这个教会是真的属于耶和华的。And in so doing， 在云朵降临之后 ，She will now have authority。教会就拥有权柄。She'll now be able to execute to establish the agenda of God on the earth. 教会能够执行神在世上的计划了。
And that means the Lord is now baptizing the church under the cloud. 也就是说，神现在在云上亲自对教会洗礼。Do you remember when He baptized Israel under the cloud? 你还记得神在云上对以色列子民的洗礼吗 ？Their lives changed. 他们的生命改变了。They stopped focusing down here on pots of meat. 他们停止把事情聚焦在大锅肉。They were talking about big cucumbers from Egypt, pots of meat. 讨论着埃及的大黄瓜、大锅肉。We don't have them here. We need to go back to Egypt. 也不再说这里什么都没有，我们必须回到埃及。Looking down. 他们不再回头看了。But when the glory came. 但当荣耀的云降临时。The glory became the guide, the cloud, the shekinah. 荣耀的云同时也变成引导者。是神的显现。So every time the Israelites kept looking up. 因此以色列人不停地抬头往上看。Is the cloud still there? Has it lifted? 云朵还在吗？云朵离开了吗 ？The Lord changed their orientation. 神改变了他们的定位。From an earthly people. 从属世的人们。A confirmation of Egypt. 从属于埃及的人。They had conformed to Egypt. 从属于埃及的人 ，the earthly， 从属世的身份 ，they were now conformed to heaven. 但是现在变成神国的子民了。And they were receiving manna from heaven. 他们接受了从天堂来的玛拿。They were not talking about pots of meat anymore. 他们不再讨论锅上的肉了。Because on a daily basis, they received fresh manna from heaven. 因为他们每天都接受从天堂来的新鲜玛拿。That means the Lord is using this cloud. 这表示主所使用的云朵。That has come again. 已经再度来临了。To speak to the church. 主要对教会说话。He's saying, "Are you aware that the glory has come?" 主说，你们有没有察觉我的荣耀已经降临了 ？And if the glory has now come, the cloud. The Shakina. 如果荣耀的云已经来到 ，Are you aware that it is saying? 那你知不知道当中所代表的讯息呢 ？That we should stop on focusing on the huge pots of meat. 我们应该停止专注于大锅里面的肉了。The big cucumbers of the world. 以及属于世界的大黄瓜。Now we have to focus on to the bread of life. That comes from the throne of God in heaven. Now we must fix our eyes on the bread of life that comes from the throne of God in heaven. Who is the Messiah? Who is the Messiah? His name is Jesus. He is the Messiah. 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 We now have to fix our eyes on the Because there is our compass, that's our magnetic north. Because that is like a compass, just like a needle. He is the one showing us where to go. He can show 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 us where to go. So, the message is clear. 讯息是明确的。That now, because the glory has come. 由于荣耀现在已经降临了。Now the house of the Lord has become holy ground. 现在神的家也已经成为圣地了。Now we must respect the house. 现在我们必须尊敬神的家。Whatever we did before the glory came, 不管在荣耀降临之前，我们曾经做过什么 ，we cannot do anymore. 我们都不能再做了。Whatever we said casually, 不管我们说了什么随便的话 ，we said without fear. 话语中没有敬畏神。Before the glory came, 在荣耀来临之前 ，now we cannot even utter. We cannot say. 现在我们不能再随便说话了。我们甚至会因此无法进入天国。He says, "Behold." 主说，看哪
The house of the Lord has now become holy ground. 神的家已经成为圣地了。So every sandals. 所以每一双鞋。The sandals of evil. 邪恶的鞋。Of lukewarmness. 不冷不热的鞋。Of alcoholism, drinking, pornography. 酒瘾、色情的鞋。The sandals of compromise, worldliness. 向世界妥协的鞋。Must now be left out as we enter the house of the Lord. 在我们进入神的家之前，现在全部都必须丢弃了。May the Lord bless you. 愿神祝福你。The Messiah is coming. 弥赛亚要来了。Prepare the way. 请预备道路。